Nothing like a beautiful day at the harbor. We're at Friday Harbor, actually. Look at the gorgeous boats behind us. Beautiful harbor happening at City Line on the water. And when you think getting out on the water, you think, I need a snack, right? You need a drink, you need a snack. So, of course, Chef MDP is in the house. And you're doing what you do best, which is taking a couple of very traditional, well-loved recipes and smashing them together That's into exactly one it. MDP-esque dish that's what are you right making? that's right i love it what energy we're bringing here on yes. the dock hey that's dock rock let's go that's dock rock that is baby. dock rock what you know what making? you're absolutely right we're making cheeseburger quesadillas oh, so it is taking like you it. said two staples two absolute favorites mashing them together yeah. and again it's about for me it's about making stuff that's approachable it's fun yeah and it's got a little you know it's a it's a twist on both plays right so yeah. and make it easy breezy because you are out in the dock we're not talking about like a seven course uh we meal are. here we oh. want cheeseburger maybe with some big mac sauce which Come we'll talk on, about in let's a bit. do this little dip so, so good. it is good and it's fun it's approachable and you know what something like this is actually really cost effective so yeah. when you're shopping, look for stuff, you know, if it's on special, it's on feature, mm -hmm. you know, and put things together. Like this is somewhere the kids can help you as well, right? So, totally. you know, again, I, I always stress setting up. Like look at our me's, look at this right. setup. Yeah. Even though we're on the dock, we're rocking, we're having some fun. Mm -hmm. You know, we have the harbor behind us here. It's all about having stuff ready to go. And the reason why we do this, of course, in a professional kitchen or in a dock here, yeah. is the idea just that everything's organized, it's simple, we're chilling. Yeah. We can have a cold drink if we want. We can sit back, relax. Totally. Let the kids do the whole work. Well, it's a lot, or you know what? Get out of the way, kids. Get out of the way. Get in the pool, get on a floaty. That's right. And then it's like you are all organized and you can just bam, 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 get through it so easily because everything is set up and ready to go. That's exactly it. So you're starting with uh, tortilla so simple basic ingredients we're yeah. doing tortilla or if you want a really large one that's yeah. actually a burrito oh nice so do you know corn flour, flour corn you know it. what I do you prefer so uh, in this situation I'm gonna go flour reason being it's got a lot more hold to it yeah so you know if you're gonna have like a, like a beautiful sort of street taco yeah and it falls apart that's always because it's one corn tortilla generally totally flour is gonna hold together it's got that structure that you're looking for you again when you eat something like this it's like you want to <laughs> stick out you know what I mean it's right there's a, a there's, there's a street food type thing right, here, right? <laughs> Hopefully we get to do it. We're looking good here on the dock. So yeah, again, we just will remember get, that. We will get to do it. Right? I that is. You. We so will make the time. Ground beef. Obviously yeah. it's a cheeseburger. So I've got one a little started here, which is great. Yep. You can crank that up. Um, extra lean. And again, okay. once you've cooked this, you can just strain that out. Yeah. Let's reduce and keep all that fat. But I do go extra lean. But when we're putting this together, and again, yeah. we're getting, you know, we'll add as we go. I do a little bit. We can go in. I'm doing a little bit of Cajun seasoning in here. Mm -hmm. A little bit of pepper. Yeah. So you didn't just a like take of, the total a shortcut little, and do the taco seasoning. A little bit, you can. A hundred percent, you can. No, but you're you're chefy. But you I know what? I like to it. have I like to have the flavors, and you can yeah. build. You know what I mean? I want to know what's going in. Totally. So when you get a yeah. packet of something, uh, you always you don't <laughs> yes. necessarily know, right? <laughs> Which of what, course is what I would. What was uh, that lean right on. there? What was that secret Worcestershire. ingredient? Worcestershire. 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 Sauce. Worcestershire. Sauce. Whatever. They my know family's what it is. gonna. My family will kill me because I can never pronounce it properly. No one can. But what we just did is we built a lot of flavor here. Yeah. We have our quesadilla. We have that rocking. So I'm going to start with a little bit of cheese. Are you a you cheese fan? You go for the cheese. And I just want to mention if you are dealing with any meat out of yep. the dock, if yep. you're dealing with your chicken or your beef, obviously you're keeping that in the cooler. Maddie had it on ice up to the very last minute. Totally. Because you want to make sure that you are, your food safe. You have to. Uh, and then with the cheese, like, let's talk about this. Do you buy a big bag of the grated, like, mixed cheese? Are you doing it yourself? So two ways. Again, if you're shopping for economics, yeah. you want to buy the block, grate it yourself. Right. You know, we're chilling out here. We're relaxing. Again, mm -hmm. I'm, we're making this easy today. Yes. This came, and again, this is something that I look for. It was on feature. It was on special. So it was a great value. Yeah. We put it together. Again, it's tough out there, right? Like, it food is. costs are rising. Yeah. So we got to be smart what we're doing. Doesn't mean you can't, you know cut corners you have to cut corners or anything you can still have great quality great ingredients Absolutely. just be smart just be smart when you're shopping so we built our flavors yeah. i always want to brown the meat essentially for three to five minutes you're just because you're going to heat it a little bit here as well too yeah but again cooking it fully through tortillas down i've got this on a high heat again these are nice little burners right yeah yeah, yeah. and they again do we're job. doing this so exactly so don't get intimidated have some fun pull out your little barbecue we've put that shred shredded cheese that's mozzarella and cheddar why did we do both why did you do both I'm so glad you asked i mean Tracy. i'm happy you did so glad you asked tracy moore so we did this because you want one a little pull action yeah and i want that aged, mozzarella. i want that aged cheddar for that body that Absolutely. strength right yeah so here we go this is where it gets fun so when you dress your favorite cheeseburger, what kind of stuff? 
are you putting on? I'm definitely putting always ketchup. Okay, thank you. So we are um, doing that in our kitchen here. So Something you probably have not right? seen on a quesadilla, but it right? makes sense as a cheeseburger quesadilla. Thank you. I'm doing mustard, but thank it's you. like, let's not go crazy. I, okay. I love, a little bit of mustard. I love mustard. Can we meet in the oh middle? Oh, my god. I absolutely love mustard. Okay, but this. Relish. I'm about the relish. So I was going to ask it's you. It's controversial. It apparently. is controversial. So I, love relish. I actually cannot stand it. Really? Uh, yeah, it doesn't mean we can't do it. I guess I'm eating that one. Well, it's okay. This will be, we use shares. We'll meet in the middle. I, like, I love it so much. Yeah, I love the pickles. I'm the sort of person that gets, like, please, extra pickles on the Me side. Too. I just wanna, Me too. Me too. I just want to When you order your favorite burger, it's like, can I please have extra pickles? Yeah. I do it all the time. So you do a pickle, but you won't do relish, you weirdo. I am a weirdo. <laughs> no, but you know what? Because these are in full form and it's not like loose, saucy. So what we've I'm not done. Judging or anything. No, there's not judging. There's no judging on the dock. <laughs> so we're just gonna fold it over. That cheese is melted. We're gonna do this in lifetime. We're just You're gonna brave. spin that, so right? You even did the pickles in a way, like I thought you would have wanted no, to do the No, no, this is because we're gonna no. cut it. Watch, we have He's that rocking on one side. Thank you, bold and brave. Here we go. Getting so, the crispy, getting a little the tortilla that crisp, to have exactly. a bit of crisp is actually a minute. really important. I don't want it to be a floppy quesadilla. No, you want to hold it. You yeah. want to, like, look a at these. Of, look at that. A little bit of crunch. Look at that crunch. So we're going to do this as well here. Lifetime. Flip that. Look at this. You're going to flip that, we're and I want to talk a little bit about the sauce. Please. Because this, for me, is sort of the piece de résistance. Yes. What kind of sauce is So this? if you're making... If you're making true burger sauce, yeah. call that like a Big Mac sauce, if yeah. you will. So do you know what the secret ingredient but generally is? did you is? make it yourself or did you get it from a bottle and go Pfft. So, hey, chef can never lie. Chef, can, chef can sorry, chef, okay, that's from a bottle. It is. And you know why? Because again, we're out here, we're making it easy, make it approachable for people. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. But if What's you are gonna make that for home, yeah. relish, yeah. and the secret ingredient is Thousand Island dressing. Ooh. Thousand Island dressing. Let's that's what gives us its, its pretty natural Can you bring color. that board to me for a second? <laughs> Here. Trace, slide that over just a wee there bit. There you go. Thank you. We're going to throw a little cut on that. Let's There's just jam that over. Knife Thank right you. Here. And let's. Do you want me to eat from here or from here? I think you want to. Well, you can eat from wherever you like. But yeah, I think, make it a little think, teeny one because I just want to dip do, it in the sauce. Right? Check this out. Look at that burger toppings going over. So everywhere. we got a beautiful oh my cheeseburger God. I'm, I'm gonna, in the form. I'm going to wear all this. Do you remember how we're doing it? You got a mm -hmm. stick. Oh my gosh, oh my it's God. amazing. Let's go to break. We have more coming up. City Light on the water. You got to make this at home. City Light TV for the rest of the week. So good. Oh.